Six. I am Teacher Penny Magad Fabela from Bangunbangon Elementary School, Glabria District 1. Are you guys ready for another exciting science lesson? So am I. But before we begin, I want you to say, Science is amazing. Can you say it again? Science is amazing. Great job! I hope you are comfortable wherever you are sitting or standing right now and just relax while watching attentively for our new lesson. Get ready with your module, pen, and notebook. Today, you will be able to First, demonstrate rotation and revolution of the Earth using a globe to explain day and night and the sequence of seasons. Second, Illustrate and explain the results of Earth's rotation. And our lesson is about rotation of the Earth. Reviewing previous lesson. Using the diagram, describe how the Earth rotates. First question, what are the two movements of the Earth? Second, is it from east to west? or west to east third is it clockwise or counterclockwise fourth how many hours is one complete rotation or one day and here are the answers for the first question what are the two movements of the earth the globe is a model of the earth it spins and turns around the earth moves similarly as the globe does it rotates in its axis continuously. Second question. Is it from east to west or west to east? It rotates from west to east. Third question. Is it clockwise or counterclockwise? The earth rotates in counterclockwise direction. How many hours is one complete rotation or one day? It takes the Earth 24 hours or one day to spin around once on its axis. Establishing a purpose for the lesson. Find the words related to the movement of the Earth in the given crossword puzzle. We are given one minute to answer the question. Self-check. Be honest to check your answers. Presenting examples or instances of the new lesson. Think of it. Why are people more active during daytime rather than nighttime? Think of it. What makes our activities vary or change during daytime and nighttime? Describe what are the people are doing in the pictures. Can you give the proper heading for each set of pictures? And now, grade 6, here are the standards in viewing a video presentation. First, be quiet and stay on your seat while watching the video. Second, remember all the important details shown in the video. Third, be prepared to share your insights or understanding 
about the video presented. Wake up! It's daytime. We have to go to school. I wish we only had nights and no days. Then you cannot go to the playground and ride swings. Oh yes! Mummy sends me out to play only during the day. I wonder why we have days and nights at all. Before we discuss the formation of day and night, we must recall some basics about the rotation of the earth. I know what this is. This is a globe. A miniature earth. Yes. This is the axis of the globe. And this is how the globe rotates. Wow! So the earth has an axis? The earth's axis is an imaginary line that runs through the poles of the earth. And as I see in the globe, the axis is tilted at an angle. Yes, at 23.5 degrees. And the movement of the earth on its own axis is called rotation. All this is clear to me. But why do we have days and nights? To explain that, I need to use my magic wand. Where are you? It's so dark. I can't see anything. <laughs> Wait, I'll switch on the lamp. Wow, you are the earth. And the lamp is the sun. Okay, I'm loving this. See, the light is only falling on my front side. This is day. Now go behind me and see. Oh yes, this part is dark. So this is night. Now this is night on your front half. And day on this back part. Night here now. When the earth rotates from west to east, only half of it faces the sun. This half which faces the sun has day and the other half that does not get sunlight has night. When the earth rotates, day changes to night and night changes to day. So, the rotation of the earth causes day and night. If you look at the globe, you will notice that India and United States are on the opposite sides. So, when it's day in United States, it's night in India. And when it's night in United States, it's day in India. How long does it take for the earth to make one complete rotation? The earth takes 24 hours to make one complete rotation. Oh, that is a whole day. Yes, my dear. Now we will have a rapid fire round of questions. What is that? <laughs> I will ask you questions and you will answer me quickly and in short. And I get a chocolate as a reward? Right. Our earth moves from west to east on its axis. What is this movement called? Rotation. How long does the earth take to complete this rotation? 24 hours. What causes day and night? The rotation of the earth on its own axis causes day and night. Very good. Now the last question. Who is the most intelligent boy on earth? Uh, do not know. It's you. And why? Because I watch wakebejesus.com videos. Here is your reward. Understanding night and day using a globe and a flashlight.
Shine the flashlight horizontally on the globe. Turn out the lights. When your town is facing away from the sun, it is night. As the globe continues to rotate, light from the sun starts to shine on your town. Identify which part of the earth receives the sunlight and the part that doesn't receive. Tell what part of the day on the earth that receives sunlight and the part that doesn't receive. Based on the given activity, tell what makes day and night. Grade 6, you may now assess your performance using the rubrics flash on your screen. Based on your designated group, perform the following activities flashed on your screen and submit your output in our discussion forum. What might happen if the Earth does not rotate? What effects might it bring to the Earth itself, to the people and other living organisms on it, to the temperature, and etc.? What is rotation? It is the spinning or movement of the Earth on its axis from west to east and completed in 24 hours or one day. What causes day and night? The rotation of the Earth causes day and night. Grade 6, let's have a test. Write true if the statement is correct and false if it is wrong. I'll give you 30 seconds to answer. For your homework, describe in three sentences how Earth revolves around the sun. And this is the end of our lesson for today. I hope you enjoyed and learning a lot. Always bear in mind that science is amazing. This is Penny Magad Fabella, your science teacher. Bye!